So this is the quest version of the Sanctum. And uh, you get it in Act 10 in Ossuary. You have to look for it a little bit because I couldn't find it. Like, I think if my chat didn't told me, I wouldn't even know it was there. Because you don't... You have a 50-50 chance to run into it, basically, naturally. Okay, let's see how the rewards are. Sanctum map. Okay, it looks about the same. Are the numbers good? And how much harder it is? That's the other question. Difficult device? It seems fun so far. Okay, I lied. I got hit. No! Oh, my keybinds are wrong. Oh, no, 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 Okay, made it past room 1, only lost like 40% of... Uh, not 40%, but 40 result. Okay, those rewards seem pretty good though. I'm taking the Valors because I think I need Valors more, but that doesn't seem too bad. Cannot have Resolve Ages. How big is my Resolve Ages anyways? 5? Oh. Hell no, we don't need that. I should have actually checked the... I, I, will, I will check that after this room. The changes to the defense mechanics. And how they actually work. I could just be running skitterbots here instead of determination probably. Okay, that was a lot better. Six alchemies, okay. So, it was five, eleven percent result mitigation. Okay, that's not too bad. Eight percent chance. I don't even have evasion. Eight percent chance is pretty high for having no evasion. I'm gonna take the fountain because I messed up at the start rather than minor reward. That's fine. I'm gonna try to not be too greedy in the Sanctum to actually do most of it, if not all. It's Zizzer and is the f best TFT player in Hardcore Trade. It's over. How can you compete with this man? He has been spamming League Mechanic the entire time. Can't be that bad if this is spamming it, right? Okay, we are back to full resolve. And um, we wanna go for the Pact or for Alchemies? Probably take Alchemies. Alchemies are so OP on League Start. What the fuck is this room? I'm confused. New room. Seems really simple, but... It's unexpected.
So the guards seem to be the same, at least in uh, floor one so far. I think they said something about guards in general being different too uh, in further floors. So hopefully we get there to see. Um, the strat here is to just grab. Grab the alchemist, man. No, actually, it's packed. I'm I'm taking the pack. Let's let's try to go for full clear if we can. This makes the most sense. Find the exit. Okay, so exit room still exists. I'm assuming we don't need to full clear these. Okay, good to know. Still the oh fifty percent more damage for a run. Oh, every time. Door tax. Oh, we are getting taxed, man. I hate taxes. Why? As if it, getting taxed IRL wasn't enough, man. Fine. Fine. We got 50% more damage for it, though, at the very least. Find the exit again. It's gonna be down there. What am I doing? No, I got hit. Hey, is it? What is this layout? Is this a different layout or am I just lost? That felt different, but maybe maybe I'm just dumb. This is actually pretty good. It's not insane, but I think we take this. Because we don't have any inspiration relics. More scours, holy. Okay. I'm level Divan Bussing. Find the exit again. No, it's the same room. Wait, no. It has a random exit. Like, it actually has a random exit now. Well, I mean, at least 50-50. Nine chance orbs. I will take chance orbs over ball orbs here just to be able to buy maps. So we have everything at the end of the floor, but still, that's pretty good. Boss time. Still the same boss. I mean, uh, XP seems decent. I don't know how much I got there, but I leveled. Nine chance orbs, six alchemists, eight scours, three val orbs, four more scours, five GCPs. The sanctum is OP. I didn't get a new sanctum though. Do you only get one floor from the quest one? It looks like it's one floor only. Wait, no, that doesn't make sense. Because it lets you continue. Did I miss the, the book? No? I thought you get continuations. Maybe it's a quest from... Uh... Oh, it is a quest, I guess. Is it? Oh, okay. It might be. Oh, I think you can just continue from here. Okay. I was just confused for no reason. Don't worry about it. Okay, Radiant Fountain for sure. Find the exit again. So the exit here used to be like there somewhere. Okay, it's still here. Radiant Fountain. Oh no! I have the oh indomitable plank was a mistake after all. Oh I have V trolled, man, that's my bad. Oh I shouldn't have taken it. I thought I wouldn't have inspiration because I didn't have any inspiration relics, but then turns out we would still have a lot of inspiration. It's it's over. It's over. That's sad. 
Would have been an easy full clear if I didn't do that then. Oh well. I guess it's not over yet. Just play better. And I hate that I did that. Listen, I had my reasonings for it. Turn turned out to be a mistake. You learn for next time. Hundred twenty seven. I mean, we're kind of fine. I don't know if this is gonna be full clear though. Maybe we can remove it with like tainted pack or something later. Get lucky. We should do gunblood here for the fountain for sure. Find the exit. Wait, that's new. Those are not the balls that I expected here. Okay, that was still easy room though. That was still a very easy room, but no balls anymore. Wonder if they change that everywhere. Oh, not this boss. Please die without me dying. That wasn't too bad. We didn't lose that much, but ah, <sighs> this was sucks. Nine chance orbs. I don't want bless orbs. Oh, packed. Okay, the packed could technically save us, so I think we're gonna go for packed here. I just realized it says Arias has the same layouts for all players. What does that even mean? Is the tutorial sanctum the same for everybody? I wonder if the boots and stuff are the same for everyone too. Well, if they are and you're listening to this before you did that, definitely don't take the this pack. The indomitable pack. That was a mistake. If it's actually a fixed seat. Okay, come on. Ah, uh, rip. Can do that. This is worth it. You stare into the abyss, we got mon. No, what did we get? <laughs> Traps, impactors. Oh, regals, though. Nice. We need regals. Man, it feels like there's a lot of currency reward cells in Sanctum. I don't even know if they nerfed it. Like, I feel like the numbers are the same as they were in Sanctum League. Find the exit rooms are still... still nice. Is this one in the middle somehow? Oh no, I missed it there, in the corner, I think. I'm gonna take bindings to fix my gear still. Okay, this is the power of detonate death. This is the best fight for this build. I was seeing you. Too much 
Yeah, I mean, DD is insane. Also, I got almost to full level again. Oh, this is so good for SSM, man. Like, you get here, you... At, like, level 62 or whatever, you do a full Sanctum, you gain a bunch of levels. I'm gonna try for those. And I'm gonna grab gen orbs for maps. Seems really good. Like, really, really good so far. I got the relic. What is the relic? Coins. Resolve. Eh. Not the worst. What do we have? We have Chaos Orb. Kind of want to go here. But I have to... That's probably fine. Sure. I will take that. Lose some damage here. Find the exit. So, so far there hasn't been too many differences compared to Old Sanctum, but I've seen like at least one new room and one new trap, trap type. Well, not really new, it was just the, the, the balls had different skin now. Uh, unmakings? No, we take the fusings here. We won't use unmakings for a while. Okay, unholy lair into holo worship. Defeat all guards and rare monsters. Okay, so this is where the change kind of starts. You actually have to kill rares in Sanctum. Some people are gonna get bricked by by rares, man. Uh, you get one bad fire fire ignite resistant life regen rare. And I have to play safe because I don't know how much result you lose from for hits from rares. I'm trying to play very scared. Keep running out of ES too. I could just kite this onto a boss, but. Actually, maybe I should. Okay, they definitely scale in HP. Like, the floor free guards have a lot more HP. I also got the less damage thing, obviously, but... It feels a lot harder than the previous floors. I don't know if the rare even died. Let me go back and double check. It didn't. Is that now? DD should still be really good. You get a lot of Val DDs and Oh my! I almost died like character wise, not even resolve wise. Like I think if I didn't have determination there, I could have been dead. You still lose your character if you die in Sanctum, right? <laughs> I, it never happened to me, but I, I feel like I saw a clip on like Leak Star of Sanctum of people dying to the overlap stuff. Try it? Uh, no, I don't think I will. Lost some resolve. Okay, monsters have less. Oh, that's not even that good. Action speed. The reason I didn't click monsters have less life is because it doesn't actually affect DD, so. It just didn't make sense to click. This is just find the exit. Hey, they changed this room too, right? This was the one of the rooms that was just... Exited at the start. 
Or is that is this a different one? I'm not sure. It looks like it has like different corners, so maybe the exit is always in one of these corners. Yeah, okay. It is definitely different there. Reduce merchant, no. Um I'll YOLO this. You stare into the abyss. What did we get? Gain when you oh that wasn't good. I yolo it because I'm not confident in full clearing this. High high priority is zone breaker. It should be pretty high priority. That item is extremely good, especially if you are in hardcore. If you are in softcore, you don't have to care as much. Looks like someone died in SSF. Take the fountain. I would still probably use Dawnbreaker in SC. You can go for a damage shield, but once Dawnbreakers go cheap, I would still recommend using them. I haven't been getting load screens myself, so I didn't have that issue. So I have a question, Chad. I know there is Lysia now in every Sanctum. How difficult is she? Because my character is not ready for any combat. Have you guys watched anyone kill her? Oh, it was Karn who died. Oh. Or, does this, or does the quest Sanctum even have Lysia? I guess is the other question. But I would assume it does. I collect some end of sanctum, end of sanctum stuff that makes me want to get baited, but. I know my character shouldn't be able to handle her. Unless she's like super underturned, because I don't even have Bastion. I legit have 2.5k life, no defense. Yeah, I'm, if it's phase 2 Lysia, I'm not entering. There's no way. Like, I may, might be able to do it if it was softcore, but even in softcore, I wouldn't want to risk it. Scared there. Hundred twenty eight resolve. I don't know if I can even clear this floor, man. I'm low on resolve. That's a that's a scepter. It's a shame it's a spell damage, but maybe Nick would want it actually. Just playing fire trap. Eh. I guess it's not that good, but it, it's decent. I'm gonna take the hmm. What's my resolve? I'm gonna take the Chaos Orbs here. It's because I'm starting to lose hope of being able to full clear this.
Rip Garn, I've watched the Rip Clip after. Oh, let's see how this boss, go boss goes. I might fail the Sanctum here. I got hit there. I'm dead. Yeah, my character's kind of weak. The Sanctum feels harder than it did back when it was like current content at level at this level. Because I think back then this character would have not had any issues on killing this. But I also messed up with the boons like really hard. This boss fight is slightly different than it was. Very slightly. Oh, I got hit by that. Oh, no. Close. Well, we are down. The question is that I want to quickly check is can you get a new quest sanctum before I leave? And go continue mapping. If I go here and I try to look for Sanctum, what happens? Can you permanently... F because if you can permanently farm them, that is a very decent way to farm currency. You just take end of floor rewards and whatnot. I'm assuming you won't be able to, but let's check anyways. No, you cannot. Okay. Good to know. Good to know. So, I still think Sanctum is like pretty insane overall. Definitely worth doing in Act 10. Ideally, you would make your character stronger for it than my character was. And uh, don't mess up with the boons. But other than that... I'm glad it's there. Like, it fixes a big issue that people have in Act 10 with a lack of currency. And it gives extra XP too. Like, it fits the game perfectly, honestly. There. Like, look, I got like 23 chance orbs, a bunch of alchemies, two regals, valor, some fusings, 12 scours. Like, it was very, very well, 